In the last video, I showed how to get past the authentication when calling Pardot or account engagement from uh, Apex and Salesforce. The next step, someone asked, how would I go about inserting a new prospect into Pardot? Here, I've created some sample code. And um, the, way that I, the way that I figured this out was starting by looking at the documentation. This is the main site for the Pardot API now called account engagement go to guides and then i went to version 5 docs and then prospects here i can see if i want to create a new one we're going to be using this objects prospects and when i go further down i think what i did was i just searched this url to jump down All right so here's their example to create prospect the thing i didn't like about their example is that they don't show the business unit so it's really important that this business unit is in the header. I think you'll get an error if that's not in there. They pass the prospect that you want to insert as just JSON in the body of the request. There's a lot of ways that you can generate this in Apex. On many projects, I'll create a class that has all of these properties on it and then serialize the class. But another way that's kind of handy when you're just playing around is to create a map of strings and then just add entries to that map and then just serialize that. It'll end up being in the right format. It's really just a matter of having the right endpoint. Oh, and this is and passing in the fields that are on the on the object that you're creating. Use a post instead of a get that's telling it that it's gonna create. Make sure you have the business unit, construct the payload to whatever you want it to be, and then make the request. So I'll go ahead and call this. I'm just gonna execute anonymous. And in the response, I have the ID of the prospect that was just created. And I can come back into the system and refresh. And this is that record ID, email address, first name, last name. So that's it. I'll put this snippet in the body of the YouTube video. And if there's anything else you want to know how to do, uh, just let me know. Happy to help out.